Now on WSAR's Breakfast Club, it's the Bristol Community College Update. A monthly visit with President Laura Douglas on 1480 WSAR and 95.9 FM. Sponsored by Bristol Community College. Dreams within reach. Visit bristolcc.edu. Alrighty, 8.46 on a Monday. Spend a little time in studio. We don't get that that often here at, here at SAR because, well, we've been doing it on the phone for some time. Uh, talking to Laura Douglas, the president of Bristol Community College. Uh, I guess it probably started with, a, I mean, going back to the pandemic, I guess, huh? Yeah. That's right. It's yeah. just easier, but it's great to see you in yeah, person, nice as always. Yeah, to see you in person. And we are pleased also to have along Michael Benavides, who's with the Portugalia Marketplace. Great place, Michael. Thank you very much. Oh, Appreciate every that. Every time I drive by, this, said, what a great place that is. Uh-huh. It really is. All right. So it's nice to have you along. Both of you are here for... A very special event, the, yes. the Fabric Arts Festival. Yes, we've never talked about the Fabric Art Festival, but we have a great new partnership. Um, Michael has uh, really expanded the festival this year, and we've got two events happening at Bristol Community College uh, coming up the weekend of the uh, 14th. So, Michael, you want to talk about uh, which one you want to talk about first, the art installation or or the Gisela Zhao uh, Either concert? or. We can start off with the uh, with the exhibition. Uh, the exhibition is by uh, an artist uh, from Somerset, actually. We're sitting in Somerset right now, but yeah. Alison Vieira, uh, who's of Portuguese descent, who lives in New York City, who's got a, a burgeoning art career, uh, who's a, a, a professor as well at in uh, D.C. at George Washington. Uh, she's got a, um, a very successful art career, and she's a part of our festival. She joined the festival last year as an artist in residence, and then this year uh, she's involved in two different situations in the festival. So she's... Uh, part curator of uh, an exhibition that's called uh, Unfinished Concrete Ideals that'll be at the City Hall. Uh, But then she's also got a solo show that she's going to be installing at the pond at uh, Bristol Community College. Uh, So, yeah, and that'll be part of uh, the open studios that will be hosted by FRAC. FRAC is organizing open studios for the for the weekend uh, for Fabric. And so uh, as part of one of the stops, uh, this exhibition called Repose, will be installed around the pond. And, you know, right now the pond is really beautiful. We've got the Mm -hmm. trees turning colors. It's so serene. I think it's going to be a beautiful backdrop. We have a lot of people who come out to the campus to walk. I hope they'll come out on Saturday to see this amazing um, piece of art. It's a nice scene setter. That is for sure. Yeah, 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 it'll just be gorgeous. Yeah, Yeah, no, it is. It's, It's a beautiful setting. The campus is beautiful. Uh, and so uh, Allison was drawn to it. We showed her the space. We showed her a few spaces. She liked that space. So we're, we're happy to have her uh, installation. There. So Michael, take us back just a little bit uh, on the whole history of this, this arts festival. I mean, fabric yes. certainly fits with the city of Fall River. No question Correct. about that with all our, our old mills and all of that. Well, yeah. And, and the name is, is uh, paying homage to the city's uh, textile heritage History, yeah, yeah right and also the fabric you know it represents the fabric of the community as well so but the festival is a festival that i i started uh and it's hosted by connie casa de sorge nova inglaterra i started it in 2019 was the very first edition we uh uh put together an arts festival that's an international arts festival with some curators from from the azores uh, i was inspired by the work some of the work they were doing in the azores and i was really interested and intrigued so we started talking about doing a festival in Fall River uh, that was similar to the festivals they were doing. And it was an idea of bringing contemporary Portugal to the community. Um, And it's since then grown. We were able to uh, do two editions during COVID, which was uh, very challenging, difficult, but it it proved our resilience. Uh, And here we are, uh, you know, fourth edition later, and this edition is a regional edition. So uh, we're broadening our our horizons a little bit with this one, but it's, it's, it's interesting and cool. So this is a great partnership for Bristol Community College. Right? Yes, is, well, yeah. you know, when when Michael started this concept, uh, we met early on and we talked about how we might be able to launch it. And he certainly wanted to do it downtown Fall River. And I said, you know, what about Bristol Community College? And so it's grown now and we're happy to have um, something sponsored here 
this year. And I just want to make sure everyone knows that the art installation, that's free for everyone. So mm -hmm. we want people to come out at five o'clock on Saturday uh, to our uh, Fall River campus at 777 Ellsbury Street. And then we want them to stay for a concert, a very special concert. And we just renovated our Margaret Jackson Theater. It's absolutely gorgeous. Mm -hmm. And this will be really the largest event we've had since it's remodeling. So tell us about this great concert. Yeah, so this concert is really, uh, uh, to date, probably one of our biggest uh, acts that we've, we've brought to Fabric. So uh, Gisela Joan is her name. She's a Fadu singer. Fadu, for those of you who are listening and don't know, is the, the sort of the the music of Portugal. It's it's the genre that defines Portugal. If you, it's, if you, bit, it's kind of dramatic, isn't it? It's yeah. very dramatic. It's very uh, oftentimes uh, known to be the blues or melancholic. Uh, but Gisela João is the new fresh face of Fadu. She's very, she's young. Uh, she's vibrant. She's got a different uh, personality style. Does she have a different approach to Fadu? Uh, so st stylistically, it's Fadu. It's got a back line with yeah. a Portuguese guitar and so on and there is a fair amount of drama but she but she does have lyrically she's very uh contemporary she's very uh interesting even uh, her stage presence she's not you know in black with a shawl almost crying on stage <laughs> so this is this is a slightly different approach she's okay. she's getting a lot of accolades she's well traveled she's playing paris the week before coming to fall river wow I'm yes not sad. yeah My so people goodness. don't really realize she's part of this world music circuit she tours all over the world she's playing in miami at, at a big music uh World Music Festival in February. So we have, it's a real honor and a real treat to have her uh, in Fall River. Uh, you know, it's just something that I think people would be really, if they come out, they'll be really astonished to see that level of, of uh, you know, showmanship and wow. quality. Yep. But people will need tickets and okay. they're going to need to go online and get those tickets pretty soon. Um, though they can be purchased at www.fabricfallriver.com dot com and remember that saturday also the tickets can be purchased at the, Z the zyterian at so the i have zyterian. to say this is a That's collaboration right. with the zyterian we also like we've been wanting to collaborate with bcc we've been wanting to collaborate with with the zyterian this year has been a lot about collaboration so we've we've partnered up with many different entities the as we know the uh, uh the z is currently under renovation and they're doing a lot of programming off-site so we approached them about the gisela joan show they immediately mm -hmm. accepted uh, so we created this partnership and this is, I would say like a three-way partnership yeah. between BCC, the Z and fabric. So yeah, great. it's, it's great. I think three great entities, two very established entities, uh, with a startup entity. So it starts this weekend, right? Am I correct? Okay. So the, the festival starts this weekend in Providence. So it's a regional festival. Okay. So it starts this weekend, uh, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday in Providence. There's multiple events. I suggest folks go online to fabricfallriver.com okay. to see the program. Uh, and then throughout the week, there are certain programs with some of our artists who are giving master classes at RISD and at various universities and, and classrooms. And then next weekend is the Fall River. Well, Thursday, we go to New Bedford to the Whaling Museum, okay. another partnership. That's good. Uh, yeah, and we have an Azorian-themed evening with uh, a short film and uh, a concert, free for all. Uh, and then on Friday, we have uh, an exhibition that's opening up at a new space in Fall River called Gather on 44 Troy, which is a, a really going to be, a, I think, a really fabulous space for the city of Fall River. And then, sort of, and then Giselle. And then Giselle is one on yes. Saturday. Yeah. And that one we can't forget about because that is a real treat. That is the, the highlight. The, yes, sort of the, the culmination yes. and the end of the festival. Correct. So it ends with Gisela. It's, yeah, that's the, the sort of the icing on the a cake. A nice grand finale, don't yeah. you think? Yes. 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 8 p.m., Bristol Community College, right. Margaret Jackson Theater. I hope people will sign up and get tickets because this is going to be spectacular. No, no tickets at the door, probably, right? Uh, that, that's a good question. Uh, I know we're, we're selling tickets at Portugalia. Okay. Uh, so those are the ticket, tickets can be purchased at Portugalia. Okay. Tickets at the door. I, I assume Dave show if tickets are available, then they will be available at the door. I, but don't hold me to that. That's I, that's something I have to check with the Z, the Z about. I should have known that. That's all right. Yeah. Well, listen, this is great. My goodness. Hope folks will, will join in and celebrate this this wonderful idea. Thank you. All right. Uh, and the weather's looking really great. I have to tell it, you, I looked better, in, it, a, in advance for that beautiful rain. art installation <laughs> at the pond at Bristol Community College, and it looks like 
it's going to be sunny, beautiful. The colors should be in full light. Just just a great way to celebrate everything in Fall River. Yeah, it's, good. it's not going to rain because there is no rain left. I think right. we've yeah, you might be right about that. Let's, <laughs> let's hope you're right. All right. Have a yeah. great, uh, great uh, festival, and uh, we appreciate you being here. Thank, Thank you. you for having us. Thank you, Tom. Thank you. All right. Thank you.